Finally, it's a done deal. Samsung is finally bringing back the biggest dread of Galaxy lovers after a two-year sabbatical. And while I would prefer that this were untrue, it is. Now that the Exynos 2400 is official, there are a lot of upgrades to anticipate. Spoiler alert, you'll be greatly let down by this. In comparison to the Exynos 2200, our CPU performance has increased by 70% and our power efficiency has greatly improved. With RDNA, a 3 architecture, we have AMD graphics of the most recent version installed. And despite how incredible it may sound to you, the GPU performance on the Galaxy S23 series is just marginally quicker than the 8 Gen 2. So, to clarify, the Galaxy S24's GPU will be slower than the S23's from this year. It's actually very, very disappointing that Samsung is the only company accomplishing this. Exynos 2400 is around 15% faster in AI processing than Exynos 2200 from last year, according to Samsung. But in all honesty, this CPU can't even compete with the Snapdragon and Gen 2 from this year, let alone stand a chance against the Monster A Gen 3 that will power the Galaxy S24 series. The difference between Snapdragon and Exynos has never been this large in various areas. Once again, the lesson is to never have high hopes for Samsung's Exynos processors since they are simply not what we had anticipated. The fact that Samsung will continue to make the Galaxy S24 Ultra Snapdragon and Gen 3 exclusive is the sole positive aspect of this. Prepare yourself for this horrible news regarding the Exynos 2400. L claims that the market would be divided into Europe, Latin America, Africa, and Asia. This includes South Korea, which is Samsung's home market, as well as India, which has the largest smartphone market. I have open ears. Please share your thoughts in the comments section. L is the source of this report, and they are typically fairly accurate with this kind of information. The Snapdragon Ag Gen 3 will be available on the S24 and S24 Plus in China, the US, and Canada. One more time, only the S24 Ultra is a Snapdragon exclusive variant. This saddens me greatly because this year's S24 Plus is a real beast. Many people would be interested in purchasing this. I'm sorry to say it, but if you live in Asia or Europe, you're probably going to be taken advantage of unless you purchase the Snapdragon model from a different region, or simply, the Ultra model. It appears that Samsung is now merely attempting to market the Ultra model in any manner possible. Please share your thoughts on all of this in the comments section. So with that, I'll talk to you all later. Peace out.